all right hi good morning guys so uh, in this video i want to design the home page that provides many menu for your application in the sketch app and then i want to implement it into android studio by using the relative layout and we can setting the layout like we design it in sketch app okay so i want to create new document here choose and then create go to insert to create new artboard and i will choose the mobile portrait from material design and this is my mobile portrait and you can change the name your artboard to the home page all right so uh, it's only simple and then i want to create new background here shape and rectangle for the background and remove the border and change the fill color to the another color like this it's uh, very silver alright so the next one we need to change the name the rectangle to the background and we group it and background okay so it will be very simple because we need to design one item and then we need to copy 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 again but the uh, before you design i have prepare preview many icons here uh, i'm download it from flaticon.com you can download uh, i need the six icon different but it's still uh, same the style icon okay well we need to create the rectangle first for the content rectangle okay like this and then i will put one two three sorry mistake one two three one two three okay and remove the border and we can see the width and height its uh, perspective i want to change to uh, 130 okay it's enough and i will duplicate this layer and move to the right and the content it shall be like this uh yeah and then i will group all of them group and uh, make it to center like this and we can create the icon here and the label of menu here so it doesn't matter what we just need go to vendor and i want to copy my icon here i want to copy and then i will paste here and make it to center like this okay and then i need the label in the below of the icon in the below of the icon we need to create the new text here you can give the name is menu icon because i don't know what what can i write it's only simple you can change with your favorite name and then i will change the color to the black okay it's black and then you just need make it uh, center with the with the container center like this okay and then you can group again you can group selection and get the name is item and we can duplicate the item item and move like this and remove the rectangle copy okay we got like this and then we can copy the item and make it to uh, six item and one two three four okay and we can duplicate again one two three four all right so uh, the, the home pads uh, it will be like this okay 
and you can make it uh, different from the icons i will copy one by one copy and paste and make it to center and remove and then go back and copy sorry copy and paste and make it to center again and remove just repeat the steps till you're finished the uh, homepage design just be patient i know it's uh, really bored because you just do it uh, same steps i know that feel bro copy and then pass like this and like this we can make it clean okay i think it's enough so you can see the rectangle here just click the i to hidden your background content so i will hidden one by one hidden 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 and more more like this okay so you have this and the home the home page and then you just need to implement it into android so we just need to slice one by one you can see the icon absence here you can uh, select the icon one by one and then go to make exportable and export the layer and you can create new folder here for the asset okay create and export before we go away we need to check the asset has export okay we have the one two three four five six it's good well done well we go to android right now okay android studio and I want to create start a new Android Studio project and you can give the name to the home page and next and we will use the API 14 just next and empty activity next and finish and just waiting for several time for preparing our workspace in Android and it's still running you can see gradle build running right here Okay, just waiting and be patient. Alright, so we go back to activitymind.xml and you can see the icon here with uh, Android include the DA for the preview. Okay, it's your preview. You can click here and delete. Sorry, uh, you can select a uh, text view and delete. Okay. And you have the title of menu here with uh, home page. It's good for you. Okay, the first thing we need to do is go to Finder, and I will uh, copy the assets and go to your directory with uh, Android directory with uh, home page, and go to App Source and Main and Rest and Drawable, and you can press all of it I want to change uh, icon 1 with the simple name icon 2 and icon 3 and 4 and 5 and the last one it shall be 6 oh my mistake sorry we need the underscore yeah we did it and then it's simple name right Okay, so you can see uh, right here is relative layout. We need to change it to linear layout. Okay, done. And then we need to divide with the. Uh, we go back to sketch. You can see it's uh, different column. We need to divide it with the two column. Okay, so we need to create the linear layout here, which. Uh, match parent and match parent and then you can get the background for the sample uh, sorry my mistake ok 
okay like this and then you can get the weight to one and the gravity to center and the orientation to the vertical because the uh, the the item it shall be good to bottom it's so you need to vertical it okay and then I will copy this linear layout and paste in the below and change the color to the another color with a black color and then you can see here we have divide the two columns for our item so just go ahead select the uh, the first linear layout here and tap enter enter and then we need to create linear lay layout again so linear layout and match parent and wrap content and we can get the background here for the sample again okay and then the orientation vertical okay so instead of linear layout we need to create the image view you can setting HTTP HTTP and setting the background to drawable and the icon one okay and then I want to uh, make it to center this one sorry uh, we can get the graffiti here center so the, the image it shall be to center and below of image view we need the text or label so text view wrap content and wrap content and get the text uh, name icon and we need the margin top it's 20 dp no it's 10 dp okay it's enough and then we need uh, text size to maybe 16 dp okay so uh, the actually it's done you just need to copy copy and make it clear but don't worry i will show you so i select this background and remove and then i will copy this this one copy and i will pass one two and you get it okay but it's still work i know that so we can undo and undo and you can see the linear layout here you can get the padding uh just 30 dp okay and we try to get the background again to see the result the result like this and then we can copy copy again and paste in the below so we got like this pretty cool right but you can see here it's worth okay so you can decrease the padding to 20 and 20 and the padding it's 20 and you got it so you just need to trim off the background and change the name of icon to the tree and remove the background and change the icon to the two like this and remove the background and remove the background tara you got it uh, in the right set we just need copy this layer sorry layer <laughs> copy this source code copy all of them and then paste like this and change the name of icon to the 6 to the 5 to the 4 and you got it Okay. and I want to run in my emulator so we can see the uh, result I'm using the Galaxy Nexus with uh, API 19 
is just waiting for the gradle build okay here we go this is our result and correct to lesson you have to learn about relative layout uh, sorry <laughs> you have to learn about linear layout that help you to create the home page like this so please let me know if you have any questions so i will help you okay well don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel so you can get the update and it's free you don't need to pay me okay well so nice to meet you from indonesia see you the next video tutorial goodbye